And now, America's most exciting radio talk show, The Savage Nation. And here he is, Michael Savage. Really, the one thing that actually works, you know, uh, state-run communism may not be your cup of tea, but their government works, yeah. you know, and they have f five year plans. I, I always tell our team, read the 12th five year plan, which is the segment we're in. Typically, what they're doing makes sense in the Chinese context. That's what they're doing now. You know, the new president comes in, Mr. Xi comes in, he's got an agenda, and they're driving environment, they're driving company reform, they're driving more consumerism that are the right things. So there's Jeffrey Immelt, the chairman of General Electric, which pays no taxes on five point some billion dollars in American income because they've rigged the system. He is the job czar under Obama, as you well know, because he supports Obama and supported his reelection through NBC's propaganda outlet and MSNBC's propaganda outlets. He gets away with zero taxes, in my estimation. But now it gets worse. He goes on the Bolshevik Charlie Rose's show, Charlie Rose being an overblown pseudo-intellectual who is nothing but a sounding board for the uh, Bolsheviks who run the country. And he goes there and says, state-run communism may not be your cup of tea, but the government works. They have a five-year plan. Now, the first progenitor of the five-year plan was Joseph Stalin, so far as I remember my history. And it worked very well. They had slave labor camps, and it was very efficient. Hitler also had a government that worked. Mussolini had a government that worked. Mao Zedong had a government that worked. Now, Jeffrey Immelt is using that model on PBS, and you wonder what's wrong with America, which is why I don't want to talk about it. You know what to do. If you own GE stock, you have a choice. Go to a stockholders meeting and demand they be fired. Get a new, a new chairman. I mean, he is known. I know business people, big ones, who hate this guy. They think he's one of the worst people in the history of American corporate. Uh, 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 let's just stop. In American corporations, they think Immelt is perhaps the most evil of all of them. In his naked insanity for profit, they think Immelt is the worst. So you can do it if you want. I still say GE makes great products, by and large, incidentally. And I own no GE stock. But I thought you should know that this guy is glorifying communist China's uh, dictatorial government as though it's something we should use here. Well, of course, let me give you a little hint. Obama's already trying to introduce it here. That's why I want to talk about personal questions, lifestyle questions. So play Desafinado, please. And the people can call the Savage Nation at 855-400-7282.